LinkedIn only has four filters for your job search, which only end at past 24 hours. But what if I told you that you can activate secret filters that let you see jobs which have been posted as early as under an hour, under 10 minutes, or even five minutes. Welcome guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Fafi and I am currently working three remote jobs. That is two full-time positions and one part-time position. So on here, I like to share remote work tips, remote work insights, and how we can get you a remote job. If you've been applying and you haven't been hearing back, sometimes it's not your CV that's the problem. It's the timing. You are applying late. You are applying when the recruiters are already shortlisting candidates, when they're already closed their job post, when they're not actively looking for candidates. So timing is everything, especially when you're looking for remote jobs. The earlier you apply, the earlier your CV has a chance of being seen by the recruiter. Here's something that I bet you didn't know. So when you see a job on LinkedIn that says it's been posted under 24 hours, that job could have already been there for hours already. It could have been there for maybe 23 hours, 55 seconds. You don't know that. And in those hours, that's time that other people have already applied for that same job way before you even saw it. So in this video, I am going to show you how you can find those jobs as early as possible, as early as they go live. So you can be the first person to apply for such job. That's also how you you can apply early enough that your CV actually gets seen. Oh, and if you really, really want to level your application game, stick around to the end because I have a bonus tip that's going to make your application process a game changer. So we're going to start here. You know what that past 24 hours LinkedIn filter really means? It means that a job has been posted anywhere within 24 hours. So a job that's been posted, even if it's been like 23 hours and a job that's been posted after five minutes, they are all going to come up as past 24 hours. So if you see a job that's been posted literally five minutes ago, that is the difference between that and a job that's been posted way longer because five minutes ago might mean that not a lot of people have applied to the job, which makes you one of the first few persons that can apply for that very job. Here's this little LinkedIn secret that you have been waiting for that makes you see jobs which have been posted as early as five minutes or even two minutes or three minutes. You're gonna go on your Google, you're gonna go on your browser and search LinkedIn. Open up LinkedIn, and what you're gonna do from here is head on over to the jobs section because we are applying for a job. I'm gonna first start by searching my location. That is the first thing I do. And then I'm gonna go on the date posted. So as you can see under the date posted, you can see any time, past month, past week, past 24 hours. We wanna see jobs that have been posted early as five minutes or 10 minutes. So what you're gonna do, you're gonna go first on 24 hours and show results. And let me just say we're looking for a remote job and show this. Now you have all these remote jobs appearing up, which have been posted within the last 24 hours. Now we're trying to take it down. Maybe let's start with one hour. So what you're going to do, you see when you search on here, you go on this URL here and go over to here where it says, TPRA equals ARA 86,400. This number 86,400 is 24 hours, which has been converted into seconds. So what you wanna do, maybe let's try one hour. So if you convert one hour to second, it gives you 3,600 or 3,600. Okay, so we're gonna edit that to 3,600 and you press enter. So this is just for the first hour. The results that we're gonna see are jobs which have been posted within the last hour. We've removed the jobs which have been posted within 23 hours. Now we're only dealing with the last hour. So as you can see, we have this dense yourself feeds, a media buyer, job which has been posted an hour ago with literally zero applicants. We also have an executive assistant, which has been posted 58 minutes ago, again, with zero applicants. Let's look for one more position. 
we have this revenue operations specialist. This has been posted 44 minutes ago, again with zero applicants. So this is just for one hour. Now, if you wanna take it down a notch, you don't wanna see jobs which have been posted 44 minutes ago. Maybe you wanna see jobs which have been posted, say, 10 minutes ago. Now you're gonna go on that URL again, so convert 10 minutes into seconds, that's going to give you 600. So that's going to be TPR equals R 600. And now we're going to see jobs which have been posted within 10 minutes or in the last 10 minutes. So we actually have this commission only appointment setter which has been posted seven minutes ago with zero applicants. Another job is this manager of machine learning. It's still closed, it's been posted 11 minutes ago, still close to 10 minutes, again with zero applicants. Now, let's take it a little bit down. You now wanna see jobs which have been posted within five minutes or less. You're gonna change five minutes into seconds. It will become 300 seconds. So manipulate that, make sure you have equal R300. Press enter. Let it load the results. We have this job that has literally been posted. Guys, you want results like this. This Gen AI content writer position has literally been posted 22 seconds ago and zero people. Obviously, no one has seen this job. I could apply for this because I'm early <laughs> and I'm actually experienced in content writing. So this is something I could apply for if I was not working three jobs already. But this is the kind of results that you want to see. 22 seconds. We also have this property accounts assistant, which has been posted five minutes ago. Zero people have seen it. Zero people have clicked apply. Let's move on to the next. This portfolio director position, which has been posted seven minutes ago, it's still closed. I mean, if you're gonna search under 10 minutes, you're gonna see this job. Under five minutes, you're still probably gonna see this job. And again, zero applicants have applied for this position. Let's do one more position. And this creative strategist position was posted six minutes ago, again, with zero applicants. So you can see that if you will just change the URL, you will be able to see these jobs as soon as they are posted. So now that you know how to do that, you might actually be asking, why should I do all this URL editing? Why does applying early have to be such a big deal? Well, let me tell you a little fact. According to the data from the US Federal Reserve, 41% of all job applications are submitted within the first 48 hours of a posting going live. And most recruiters shortlist from the first batch of applicants. So applying early isn't just about luck, it's about timing. You want your CV to be one of the very first few that the recruiter or HR manager is going to see. Not among the 300, they're gonna check into the spam folder. You don't want that. So applying early is just one thing. So even if you apply early, you still need to stand out. And how can you do that? That's where a customized CV comes into play. Now imagine this killer combination. You applied early, you applied with a customized CV. The recruiter is not even gonna know what hit them. <laughs> Here's what you're gonna do, just a, just a little short guide on how you can customize your CV. You're gonna copy the job description or go over to ChatGPT. Ask ChatGPT to pull out the keywords in that job description and try as much as you can to copy those keywords and put them into your own CV, making sure your CV has the relevant experience as to what they are looking for. Now, if you want to know how to do this, I made a short YouTube tutorial. You can watch the video up here on top so that you know how to customize your CV properly that it actually gets seen by recruiters. Now, I know that this trick works because as much as I've gotten seven remote jobs since 2022 by using a very good CV, I know what also helped me was timing. I applied early, I applied as soon as I saw those jobs posted. The nice thing about LinkedIn, real verified legit jobs are there. You just need to know when to apply them and when to apply is applying early. Now we actually have a testimony from a Reddit user who claims to have used this URL editing trick. They mentioned that they started applying within the first few minutes after a job went live and they say that they instantly started getting more interviews, not because their CV changed, but the timing changed. 
and that's all you need to do before you go on camping on linkedin the whole day waiting for these jobs you don't want to do that so here's that little bonus tip that i mentioned to you earlier you want to let the jobs come to you you don't want to be stuck scrolling and refreshing after every five minutes on linkedin the whole day you don't want to do that you have other things to do okay so here's what you're gonna do you are gonna set up job alerts let linkedin send those jobs directly into your inbox so you don't have to be on linkedin the whole day let the jobs come to you it's as simple as that so you can turn on job alerts for specific things. If you're looking for virtual assistant positions, set up for virtual assistant. If you're looking for an admin assistant, set up admin assistant. If you're looking for remote or hybrid or even on-site, set up those job alerts. That way you can get notified as soon as those new roles or new opportunities come in and you can apply instantly to them without you having to spend your whole day refreshing on LinkedIn. So now you know how to do this. To reiterate, I love saying that word, reiterate. Here's your full application strategy. Number one, you're going to use the LinkedIn URL trick to see jobs the moment they go live, to see jobs as early as possible so you can apply early. Number two, you are going to apply within the first hour, within the first 10 minutes, within the first five minutes. Number three, you are going to tailor your CV for each application that you are making so that every job that you are applying for, your CV is already customized and relevant to the position that you are applying for. Now, number four, you are going to set up job alerts so you don't spend the whole day on LinkedIn. Let the jobs come to you instead. It's as simple as that. So this is small tricks, small little hacks that can work for you and make a really huge difference in your application game. So this is the early bed strategy, apply early, apply smart. And if you stay consistent, you are actually gonna start seeing real results come out of this. Now that you know when to apply, which is early, you now need to know how you can make your CV stand out. So watch my CV customization video right here on the screen so you know how to make a customized CV that the recruiter is gonna love. All right, so thank you so much for watching and I will see you on the next video.